Hey guys, in this video we will be comparing rank 12 mammoth versus torrents. So here we see rank 12 max mammoths. 2, 3, 4, 0, that's the health points and the armor reduces in seize mode which is 31 and on march mode armor is 37. Speed is very poor, 37 speed and view you see 8 view on the march mode and seize mode 10 view. 240 cost, production time is quite large. Now you see damage is not bad if you think of 598 against armor 2 and against heavy armor 577 although against infantry damage is a lot less 13.5 firing radius for rank 12 max and 14 rate of fire accuracy 75 so not very good but still good good explosive radius 1.8 okay now we are back at the torrents if you see the HP 200 uh, 2600 and 10 HP so more health points compared to mammoth and armor on the march mode is 43 and on the seize mode is 29 so it has a good armor at march mode and speed 40 it has greater speed than mammoth now view 9 on march mode 12 on seize mode more views and cost will be 250 so cost is different and production time is less compared to mammoths now here we see the damage 324 against armor one better damage dealer against infantry compared to mammoth and against armor two and three the damage is almost equal uh, however the if you see the rate of fire is 30 for, for mammoth is it was 15 so torrents definitely deals a lot more damage because of a double amount of firing rate now 10.5 firing range and firing accuracy is not much good 53 56.3 so against uh, ma properly maneuvered vehicles it will be very difficult for torrent to fire on it now explosive radius 1.8 okay so we are starting one versus one and we will start both see uh, we will both take seize mode at the same time and we kept the mammoth inside the firing range of this torrent. I know this is unfair because mammoth has more range so torrent should come forward to attack and we will try that out too later. But first we are just showing you the sole difference in firepower of these two. You see one versus two. Now you see because of its accuracy it, ha it has a bit of problem but uh, some did hit the mammoth and it won with uh, almost uh, like 40 percent HP left all right next one you see 10 torrent versus 10 mammoths and both are in March mode and both will take seize mode at the same time okay now here both sides taking their modes and you see the power difference so Most of the mammoths died in the first blow from these torrents. Their firepower is extremely destructive. So if they both are in the same position, so that's actually not fair for mammoths because mammoths has more range. Uh, but I'm just uh, still showing you the firepower differences. Okay, so we will try 10 versus 10 again, but the distance is very low between them. So Torrent has the advantage in this, this kind of battle, but we are just keeping the gaps between them this time. If there are gaps between the Torrents and Mammoths, so the Mammoths might be able to do better. We will see because, you know, the accuracy is the problem for the Torrents. and they all attack on the usually they all try to attack on the same sides so gaps is really helpful for the mammoths okay so the battle is getting intense very close we I did not expect that but if you see the having gaps is really giving mammoths a very good opportunity Yes, very close. Three and three surviving on both sides. Uh, however, I think this is the end for mammoths. Just two sur mammoths surviving. Okay, this torrent needs to get closer so that it can help out these other two 
surviving Okay, three torrents surviving when this kind of formation there are gaps once of one cell between them. Alright, so here you see at the left side there are 20 mammoths that already took their position and at the right side we have 20 uh, torrents but they are not uh, able to fire the mammoths with their smaller firing range so they will come closer and uh, in this time the mammoths will keep firing on them so we will just see okay because the firing range is a big problem for okay now these should take their modes So the torrents had some casualties but when the mammoths were all together so even the mammoths were attacking earlier while the torrents were taking their mo modes the torrents are winning with 8 of them surviving still. Although many have very less HP. Alright guys so here you see there are 20 mammoths and the mammoths are having some gaps between them this time not so much congested and we have 20 torrents and these torrents are going to come forward and going to face these mammoths okay here we're going to make our moves very high casualties from the first contact and my control isn't the perfect, not nearly perfect, but I'm still trying to do something well enough. Okay, our torrents need to come more closer to get into the firing range. Now it's very difficult because the mammoths are in a quite good position and and I, I also came just too close to kill this one these people. Okay, but however you see there are eight mammoths still surviving because they were in a good position and the entrance was a bit narrower here. Okay, we bring something different for you this time. You see there are some supply centers and what these mammoths are going to do there One mammoth is going to target only one supply center. and I'm just going to show you that Distance matters when it comes to mammoths because mammoths deal higher amount of damage when it comes to destroying the supply centers of the nearer one uh, when it comes to uh, destroying the The one that is far okay uh, we're waiting to, to see more firing so this mammoth is targeting the third supply centers now you see the damage difference okay it's all same so I think I was wrong because you see what uh, the damage done by one mammoth but the supply center that is the most close took less damage because the mammoth uh, main attack hit did hit here and did not attack the supply center directly so the damage wasn't equal all over however for the first four supply centers the damage was almost equal okay here we come with the torrent we will see the damage difference this one torrent will attack this one he will attack this one and he will attack this one okay let's analyze the damage difference the most distance one uh, distant one took less damage then the closer one took uh, closer th three took almost the equal damage so you see which is uh, 
the torrents are able to deal good amount of damage even if the target is very close where for mammoths the damage to the closest supply center is very small all right so here we see eight mammoths and eight mammoths is going to destroy this one hq level five and both confederation and uh, resistance hq has the same amount of HP and armor so the attack started at 50 minute 44 second so we are just going to see how long it's going to take for eight mammoths to destroy this HQ level 5 so we will understand the their actual difference of firepower against armor 3 which is the building and heavy vehicle armor so it's already 40 seconds 40 seconds still haven't done 50 seconds so 50 seconds already gone okay so it's 57 seconds it took okay now it's time for us to see how much damage torrents can deal okay Mammoths took 57 seconds, but they're not going to take that much long for sure. Uh, 12, 13 seconds passed already. Just uh, the next blow will probably finish it off. Okay, it took uh, 31 seconds. Well, Mammoths took 57 seconds to destroy an HQ level 5, which has the same HP and armor for both factions. So that's all for this video.